Good evening, everybody. It's Bear Star here. And tonight, I wanted to share with you some of my favorite hair products. I really like to use a lot of dry shampoos and uh, serums and conditioning products. But uh, today, we're just going to focus on some of the spray products. And the first thing that we will start with is uh, this brand called Verb. And uh, this is a new brand that's being featured at Sephora. And I really like their products. Their line is very affordable and they have a lot of options. And these are three of my favorite ones so far. This is the Verb Gentle Cleanse Dry Shampoo. It's uh, for light hair. And I have very light hair. So they have one for dark hair and for light hair. And you can see it's got a little bit of violet in it. Let's see if I can. I don't know if you can see this, but there's a little bit of a violet tint with the dry shampoo. And that's just to brighten your hair if it's blonde and lighten the brassy tones. And this is $16 at Sephora. And, um, let's see, the main ingredient is the rice starch. So, a lot of dry shampoos are either made using rice starch, or corn starch, or tapioca starch. And I find that the rice starch ones are a little less heavy on your hair, and they leave less residue. I really like this dry shampoo. It's uh, really good at leaving my hair looking very full and uh, taking a lot of the oils out. And uh, it also leaves it very conditioned because a lot of times with dry shampoos, um, they end up making it really hard to brush through your hair. As usual, I'm at my art table. It's almost 11 o'clock on Monday evening. So this next product is also by Verb. And it's the Sea Texture Spray. And this is very similar to the dry shampoo. Except it offers a little more volume and texture to your hair. And also some light hold. And uh, I think this one is either 16 as well or 19. And uh, it offers light hold and volume. And uh, all of their products are very lightly scented. It's like a very clean scent. So these are. And this last one is the Ghost Dry Oil. And uh, it's for conditioning your hair and smoothing it. It's almost like a spray serum. And uh, adds shine and uh, prevents damage from washing and styling. It says it's Moringa Oil Infused. And instantly absorbs into the hair to and add a fresh scent. So usually what I'll do is, if I haven't washed my hair, I will start with this one, and then I will put the dry shampoo throughout my hair and brush it, 
and then kind of spray this throughout my hair and, and work it with my hands to give it a little bit of texture and volume. And these are really nice. And then I also really like the hairspray, which is the Verb Ghost hairspray. But uh, I need to purchase another one. I ran out. Um, also, another item that's not purchased here is the Living Proof Dry Shampoo, which is amazing. It's another one of my favorites. Uh, there's another one that I really like. It's by Dry Bar. And I've also finished that one. I go through a dry shampoo probably every couple weeks. Uh, unless I have a bunch and I try to use them up. Um, so this one is by IGK. And I want to say it's about $26. And uh, I actually do not like this one. Uh, it's, by, it's called Jet Lag. And... Uh, they have three levels of dry shampoo. This is the lightest one. And uh, they've got another one called matcha. That's the medium one. And then they have a charcoal one that is the strongest one. And I found this to be not effective at all. And I tried the other ones and I didn't really like those either. So I haven't gone through this. I need to use it up, but I don't think I ever will because I just don't like it. It ends up leaving my hair feel really uh, dry and uh, hard to manage. Um, makes it hard to brush. On this one, um, of course, the alcohol is the top ingredient. Volcanic ash. Interesting. A lot of fruit extracts. And uh, there's the potato starch. There's always going to be some kind of starch ingredient. That uh, is what they use to soak up the oils in your hair. And uh, the smell of this is incredible. And they have other products by IGK that I absolutely love. Um, I swear by the mistress anti-frizz uh, hair serum. It's not really a serum, it's more of a, like a, a gel, but I really love that product. Okay, this is another one. This is a dry shampoo by Moroccan Oil, and it's also for light tones, so when you spray it, you can see that there's uh, a bit of a violet tone. This one is amazing. It uh, smells really nice. It smells actually incredible. I really love this one. It's, um, I think it's $26. And it's extremely conditioning. Um, it leaves your hair feeling really silky and soft. It doesn't leave a residue. And brightens the tone if you have blonde hair. I would say that I definitely like this one more than the verb, but it's a little more expensive. But I definitely recommend this as well as other Moroccan oil products. They have a really good hairline and this is also available at Sephora. And the last product that I wanted to share with you guys is by Playa and I happened to sample this when I was in Sephora about a month and a half ago and uh, god the smell of this is just intoxicatingly good um, it's called the New Day Mist 3-in-1 Style Refresh and I actually learned about this from a YouTuber, uh, Jamie Page, and uh, she had listed it as uh, one of her top products, and uh, basically it's a style refresher, so 
if you've had your hair in a ponytail all day and uh, you want to get the creases out or your hair feels a little flat, uh, you would spray this and uh, you can reset your hair supposedly. Or if you've been sleeping and uh, your hair's kind of in a weird, uh, you know, like creases or something. So you lightly mist over problem areas, tousle with fingers, or brush through to reset. Um, it's almost like a spray and leave-in conditioner, and uh, the mist is really, it's really fine, and it smells almost like a, a vanilla, like uh, very sweet woodsy sandalwood musk type smell I just sprayed it all over the table but um it doesn't weigh your hair down and uh, I would spray this in my hair like when I wake up and I uh, don't want to wash my hair uh, I try to only wash my hair about three times a week otherwise it leaves it just too dry and uh then I would uh, either use my hair dryer to, uh, and my round brush to uh, restyle it, or I would spray it with a dry shampoo afterwards. So, uh, these are some of my favorite products here, and uh, all of these can be found at Sephora, and uh, I think you can get the Moroccan oil line at uh, Ulta as well. And uh, some of these you can also get at Nordstrom or Macy's uh, or Bloomingdale's. I'm uh, pretty sure IGK is available at those places. Uh, but I would not recommend this one. I would stick to these ones. So I just wanted to make a quick video about uh, these lovely products. everyone's having a wonderful evening and please leave a comment and like this video subscribe share it whatever you want to do and uh, I hope that you'll join me again for another video thank you so much